Hey guys, what's up Taurus? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. It's gonna be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with. So flip it how you need to. Wait. Wow. Okay, there could have been some secrets here. Maybe some betrayal, something like that. Because the moon's right there. But somebody's regretting that. Alright, so anyways, flip it how you need to. Also, remember... <clears throat> excuse me, it's a general reading. So just take what's yours. And leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, wow, that information is below as well. All right, let's see what's going on because that looked happier. Immediate future for Taurus. Shoot. Too many. Three cards, please. Immediate future for Taurus. Thank you. There you are with the Hierophant. There you are not paying attention. <laughs> Could be rejecting an offer or this person did. It looks like there's a missed opportunity, like I said. <clears throat> or you could have got fed up with the situation. We'll have to see. But somebody's regretting that now. Show me this higher fence. This could have had to do with a marriage, a long-term commitment, family, Things like that. Too many. Give me one card on that higher fence. Mm. Show me the Ace of Swords. Mm. Cutting through the confusion. That's what someone's trying to do. Or cutting through decisions. Oh. Alright, so somebody is expressing their feelings here. I don't know though, it's it's either like they're shy or they're just not sure. Maybe it's you. Um whoa, what the fuck? Alright, hold on. So look, it's somebody realizing they have have feelings and kind of going towards that, like reaching out, communicating, but there's still like a level there was a level of uncertainty here but the reason i said whoa what the fuck is because we have the devil the page of swords the moon right here for some of you guys there's like some spire spire stalker blah, 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 stalker spying shit going on show me the fool it's like you took a chance on your feelings or someone is they're reaching out with those feelings I don't know if it all the way landed though. Yeah, because that wasn't easy. It's like an opportunity presented itself, but for whatever reason, uh, it may have been too difficult. Hell, communication could have been blocked for all that. It still looks like you're trying to pull through though. Show me this for four cups. Because this is like those emotions, those feelings, almost just being ignored. Because the Knight of Cups is there. So somebody is coming. Oy. Tell me about that Knight of Cups. For some, I'll save that for last. You might have, you may have a proposal coming. Because it's almost like somebody tried to come forward with these feelings. And maybe a little bit uncertain or, you know, it just wasn't that easy. But they took that risk. Um... Well, maybe they didn't. Let's just see. Because right here, it's like somebody is feeling like those feelings aren't Im important. Or like it got rejected. Oh, what the fuck? The Page of Swords and the Seven of Swords. Oh my goodness. Somebody is spying their ass off. It's almost like they feel like you're going to reject their offer. Or maybe you did. But you got to look at it like this. Okay, so this is this love offer coming forward. Communication, kind of feeling somebody trying to bring those to the surface. And then it's like, it's 
So this is those feelings just hanging there. But somebody just kind of looks at them. So it could be a couple of things. Um, it could be either it was rejected. Maybe somebody is busy or tired or has other things going on. But it can also be like a self-esteem thing. Like somebody um, maybe either rejected the offer and is now regretting that. Or just didn't come forward with it. It's a general reading. So you kind of got to fit that one in to how it goes. It looks like somebody's creating a plan. But there's been some type of spying. This King of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Energy. So it's possible it's, if you're not dealing, you could be dealing with the air sign, but if not, that person may not really um, have reached out completely like and just opened up and expressed their emotions. This could be in relation to something that ended, possibly caused a separation or was because of a third party situation. So it's like somebody's coming back around trying to spark things up, but they're, they've they been doing it pretty slowly here. Definitely could have been some cheating going on. Not for all. Some things could have got revealed in the past if this is resonating. All right, show me this outcome for Taurus. So Four of Wands represents home family commitment for some of you you were dealing with a married man here because i feel still feel like with the high priestess there there may be some things that's kind of kept to oneself uh show me that temperance card because it almost looks like somebody tried to apologize or wants to apologize and that's not for all but i feel like this this is you know kind of gonna let someone down here because i don't think it's moving quite the way um someone was hoping oh it is turning around all right so there is an opportunity here that presents itself and you have somebody has a choice here on how to move forward not for all was it third party because it could just be some spying going on but i feel like there's still some things kept in because the high priestess is there so it does feel like you know there's some sagittarius energy with that temperance card you're, you're protected show me that temperance card yeah it's almost like an obsession here with the empress and the devil capricorn energy some type of an obsession so it does um it's almost like for some not for all because it's a general reading like you could be dealing with a married man it doesn't have to be or this could be the type of relationship where or situation friendship whatever it is where somebody kind of either wants their cake and eat it too or it's it's i think i've said this to you guys before it's like that game of cat and mouse like wanting what you want when you can't have it because the opportunity does present itself, like I said, and, and, you know, the choice is here to move forward. But I still feel like there's some things hidden beneath that surface with the high priestess there and this king of wands. All right, Taurus, interesting reading. What is the ace of pentacles? What is the opportunity that's going to present itself? Six of Cups, Knight of Wands, Eight of Wands, communication, somebody coming back around towards a situation, hanging out, starting over, moving forward. I do want to tell you though, you got the Knight of Wands in the middle of it, so there could be an age difference, but if you're dealing with the player in the past, this is still the player of the deck. So remember, you know, you are the Empress or Emperor, whichever one you're, you know, gender wise don't let this get you nervous don't let it get you all up in your head and shoot for some don't be naive i guess in this illusion or this confusion i should say it's your ten of cups 
your emotional fulfillment caught right in it. Oh yeah, and the sign this makes you happy as hell, so it's this makes the temptation all of the more there. Alright, Taurus. I hope this helps. I hope it resonated. If so, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, find that information below as well. You guys take care and I'll see you next time.